Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dan Deck, and today we're playing some more Astroneer. So, between last episode and this episode, I have found the first couple there, so that should put me on to four, I believe, of the obelisk parts that we need. Um, and I've been just digging a nice little tunnel this way. I've not actually got any uh, more components for tethers, but I seem to have found a treasure trove of obelisks just around this way, so... Let's just try and grab us some of these easy to get ones. So that would be five. That would be six. That one there would be seven. Good mom. That one over there would be eight. But we're getting quite far away from where I want to be now. Nine, ten, eleven over that side. If you count them, three I think there was on the left. I think there was actually a fourth one there as well. Chuck that in the middle there. Hopefully I can blow all these up with one dynamite. I've got one dynamite left on my backpack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I just drop that down a little bit so it's uh, easier in case I'm panicking to get back there without dying? Mm -mm -mm. So we've got them four right there. This one right here. I, I could quite easily go and get some more components. Um, I'm just being lazy. Get rid of all this crap. See, the hardest part about being down here is digging through all this rubbish. Now, uh, when I blow these up, I'm really hoping the stuff doesn't explode everywhere. I need to try and stack them up better than that as well. Because if it explodes everywhere, I'm then going to have to try and find all the parts, which is difficult enough as is, doing it like this. But probably wait for full oxygen. All right, let's try and stack them together a little bit neater. The blast radius on the um, explosives is fairly sizable, so... Yeah, don't, don't start teleporting up like that. Let's, let's try it. Um, if I can go right in the middle there. I'm going to go back and get some oxygen. So I'm not even going to see the explosion. They kind of look like they went everywhere, don't they? Oh, I've got the other two that's a bit further back up. So I'm not going to have all of the ones I want anyway without getting another dynamite. No. One. Two. Oh. Three, four, five, six, seven, seven, eight. Apparently you get more than um, we got from them first two that we blew up. Maybe they just blew up in every direction. I want to go back and try and get a few more. Can I just drop these off here? You know, somewhere safe. Oh, and by the way, I've been told in the comments as well, you meant to feed these things their favourite food. Otherwise, they're not active. So that's why I've not got any increased jump. And that's why I've not got a wider nozzle on my gun. Even though I've got the uh, the alien on there. Oh yeah, we've got plenty of these. Let me just fill the inventory again. If we've got enough to fill the inventory, that is. Yeah, there's more than enough. Give me this one. We're going to take all of the ones that we can. And go load them up on the train. Now, it probably would have made more sense to have um, brought the train all the way down to the bottom here. But it's fine. We didn't really need it all the way down here. I'm kind of hoping this is going to be the end for the Kalador quests. And I would like to get some of this tungsten. Did we get any tungsten before? I can't remember. Um, but yeah, to bring the train stations all the way down here would mean me going all the way back to Silver to make myself some more rail post bundles. Which I didn't really want to do. I, I know I can make hydrazine left, right and centre. But I don't want to be wasting it if I've not got to waste it. Right, let's load these up. Which I've not actually got uh, any extra storage on here for. I should have got rid of that um, organic that we've got at the back there. Let's just drop this on the floor. Because I'm not that bothered about organics. And we'll go fill up our inventory again. At least getting down there is quicker than uh, getting back up. Whee! And just down this way. 
So yeah, we've still got a fair few obelisks that we could blow up if we need any more, but I'm not sure that we're going to need any more. That one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. And one too many. Oh. I, I really don't need to take this one back up, do I? We've got more than the ten we need already. Let's just dump this with the other two obelisks that I'd got there. I was starting to think that it was going to be dead difficult to find these obelisks until I found that little um, cavern down there that was loaded with them. Once I saw that, I was like, you know what? At this point, I can start recording. I've not got to search around anymore. But yeah, realistically, I should have come up, got some more components, built some more tethers up, and we should have done it like that. Right, up to the surface we go. A nice little train ride all the way to the top. I bet there were some components on one of these levels as well. I think there was some in the roof there, but I'm not sure. Some quartz on the left. That side. I think they're the same quartz. We're going left, so keep going left. Well, that's going. Let's get comfy. Cool. There we go. I see daylight. I see daylight. Surely this is going to be enough. When we were on Glacium, we literally just needed to um, blow the ice cubes up, and then that was the end of that quest line, wasn't it? Right, I'm not sure if it's going to take them out of my backpack. So, just put all of these on there. Hopefully, it's just going to chew through all of them, even if it gets full. What is your favourite fruit, by the way? Noxious spew flower. I killed one of those before I started recording, goddammit. Uh, 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 three exo chips, thank you very much. Um, oh, we've got to read the log book. Which is uh, this thing right here. Authorise. Apologies, I'm not that bothered in the law. And that will give me 2,000 bytes. Travelling companion. Item coal. Exochip provided to Logistics Depot on Glacio or Calador. Enjoy. Uh, aluminium alloy provided Logistics Depot, Glacio, Tungsten Carbide. Copper. Yeah, we, we need all of them, don't we? Right, in that case, let me try and pick up everything that we can. I left the other thing back on uh, silver, didn't I? I'm sure I left the other thing back on silver. In that case, I'm not going to worry about collecting stuff. Wait. Oh, it's a junction bundle. That's all right, then. And it's not actually taking any more of those. Fair enough. We'll just dump those off right here. I guess we're going back to silver, thanks. We need to get ourselves all of these... Um, Alloys and stuff. Well, they're not all alloys like, but we've got plenty of flights, right? Yeah, we've got 17. Loads of flights. Absolutely loads. Alright. Which direction are you in, Silver? Right there. That shouldn't cost a full hydrazine, surely. And can we see our base? Yes, we can. Landing pad. Yep. Right, I don't think we need anything too difficult to make. And let me just take off these dynamites and the scrap that's on there. And then everything else should be able to be auto-sorted. You can go back on there. Yeah, nothing else needs to come this way. I was like, why aren't they doing anything else? It makes sense, no? Uh, just leave them there. Scramp, you can come across this way with me. Because we're going to need some more of that at some point. There you go, there you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. 
That is not what I wanted it to do. I mean, that is what I told it to do, but it's not what I wanted it to do. Yeah, I should start bringing bits of the plants back so I can have a bit of a crop field over that way. Right. So. Um, what do we need first, then? Aluminium alloy. Let's see what we need for that. Mm -mm -mm. Aluminium alloy is aluminium and copper. Aluminium we're good for. How did a copper end up here? I don't know. Right, there is your aluminium alloy done. Next up, we need tungsten carbide, which is tungsten and carbon, right? Bing. Tungsten and carbon. We should have plenty of that. Yeah, we've got plenty of that on the go. And our tungsten. We've got spare titanium, not spare tungsten. Ooh. I really do need to get some more tungsten, don't I? We are pretty darn sure. Right, there's tungsten carbide being done. Um, and we just need some straight up copper. We've got plenty of copper at the minute. And you do I need to bring anything else back? Well, I need to load this back onto the ship, but that's about all there is. Um, I should also load my explosives on there, just in case. Nope, it's not what I wanted. Go away. That railway is kind of in the way. Throw that one over that side. Right, back we go. Back to Calador. I'm still not sure if I want to do the going to the center of all the planets quests. I'm really not that bothered about doing that. We have done it once already on the first series that I did of this like a year or two ago. Mm -mm -mm. Right, I think it's that one that's just got out of view there. Just whiz back around the planet. I'm sure it's this one that was in the center. It is because it's got the little uh, icon of the uh, the train station there. Go. <clears throat> yeah, we should probably go get some tungsten while we're on here. And there's your aluminium alloy. There's the tungsten carbide. And there's your copper. And we get a traveling companion, coal. Use data log on the cabin thingamabob. What is this? Computer operated logistics engine. Personal transport installation with a friendly demeanor. Used to create the fastest trains. Provides two small trains. Do we even need to use that on this planet? Again, apologies. I'm not that bothered about reading it. And this gives us... Uh, Chronos data. Transport restock. Please deploy on silver. Oh. Place and activate the unusual device on silver's surface. Okay. I've got to see what this is like. It doesn't do much on here, does it? So what? Okay, it's got a smiley face on the front. It's a logistics engine. Train power drawer, eight units. Fair enough. Let's go back to silver. Watchers actually need that thing back on silver now. Been a lot of flying around today. You know what? I probably should have got a screenshot of the, uh, the train's smiley face. You know... I hope that, to God, that was the right one. I'm going back. I want a thumbnail. Didn't we need to waste one flight anyway? Because I did that on some other planet.
There we go. I know, right? Watching me take screenshots. <clears throat> right, we're back to 12 launchers. That makes it a nice round number again. It was always weird it being an odd number anyway. Right. Silver. There. I don't want to put this in the middle of my base this time. Should we, uh, should we try not doing that? We'll put it off to the side somewhere. I kind of know where I want it to go as well. Can I can I zoom out a little bit? Right there. Easy peasy. Zoom. Skadoosh. I'm thinking. Off over this side. So we're not really doing much with this side of the base now. <clears throat> but I don't think we need to expand it any further. All right. Oh, it's another train station. You know what then? Let's bring it in a little bit. Let's go like that. And what are we going to have to do on silver? What is that noise? This gives an actual RTG. Install medium wind turbine, install medium solar panel. What is that noise? That is creepy as sin. Just going to steal you guys for a minute. I think we've got enough RTG. Well, you know what? I can put that RTG we've just got on the base to make up for it. We're so going to have to move all these to a Trox at some point. Just so we can build proper power over that way. Mm -hmm. Right, that's day night done. Dig some chips. Provide an exo chip. Three. Look, okay, let's stockpile these. There you go. Enjoy. And that gives me a thousand bytes. Yippee. Use data log. Oh, okay. Sorry, not sorry. Oh, I think we're getting near the bottom. This has got to be the last one, right? Um, what do you give me? You give me a rail station, two rail carts, and 2,500 bytes. Lovely. Hydrazine jetpack. Transport mysterious mushrooms to the logistics depot. Silver. Why do I need another train station? Well, actually, I, I can assume why we need another train station. But why do I need two railway cars? Surely one's going to be fine. Ah. You're going to hate me. I want to go back to Calador. Can I just make a packer, please? Anybody like to guess what I'm about to do? And you know what? While we're there, we're going to grab some tungsten. I was going to do it before, but... Yeah, I think we need to do it. Mm -mm -mm, Calador. <clears throat> Did I say at the start of this episode that I didn't just want to burn through a load of hydrazine? I may have been lying slightly. That one right there. You can even see the base from orbit. That's dead cool. I like that feature. Alright. Get off of there. You come with me. Hey. That can go on there. And we can make ourselves... It's normally the second one, right? Packer, right there. Get off the rail. Let's load this on the ship now. So I don't freaking forget it. I knew I shouldn't have unpacked it. Every every one of these quests, there is no reason for you to unpack it until <clears throat> unless it tells you to. Just take this down into the abyss. You know what? I want some resin while we're here. There's some nice, ready, available resin, and um, we're going to take it. Not too bothered about the organics, but we could do with stockpiling some more carbon, so... Right. That train seemed like it was rolling away for a minute there.
you can have the organics. Yeah, I'm going to get this resin as well. So just a bit. Fill up the old storage back at base. Saves me keep having to go out. Or uh, spin the centrifuges every time I run out. Can we reach from here? I don't really want to have to start walking across. Yep, we can reach. And we can quite easily just throw it on there. I want some more. I'm being greedy. And now that we're past the surface layer, it does tend to stack up a little bit quicker. At least that's what it feels like. As you dig deeper, the, uh, the nodes get more full. Come on. One more inventory. I'm trying so hard not to dig the ones from under my feet. I think we're probably about done there. <clears throat> Let me out. Let me out. Go. Oh. Down we go. I'm glad it doesn't bug out when it's on the train. That's nice. Wasn't there a load of aluminium down here as well? I did dig a load of it out, didn't I? We're going right down here. Some more resin. I think we're okay for resin for a little bit. Okay for the quartz. Is there anything else around here close? Not really, no. And some more resin. Anything else around here close? I mean, there's that that's over there, but I think that's just ammonium, which we do actually need some of at the minute. Good God, who built this train line? It's terrible. Mm -mm -mm. That's just quartz and graphene, I think. Right, can I take this other canister down with me that's empty? Wait, is that the one that I think it is? That sounded like the spitting one. Where are you? There. Uh, um, shift. Muted hispine seeds. That is not the one that we're after, is it? Mutant noxious spew flower. Or mutant boo melon seed? Okay, yep. I know that one well. Let's go. Hey. Can't see what's happening. That's what I was trying to do. Right, are you going to be able to just stay there and not roll? Oh, there is more aluminium there. This is copper. Copper's not what we're after. Have I literally got to go all the way... Oh, it's right here, isn't it? Tungsten. There we go. We should be able to fill up on this dead quickly. Hopefully it's a nice big node. I hate leaving all these little bits, but I can't be bothered to keep getting them all. Just fragments floating everywhere. Mm -mm -mm. More tungsten. So we could keep getting it with scraps, but we're a bit low on scraps at the minute, so I don't want to keep pushing it. We want to save them if I need something, and I'm um, not willing to go and get it right that second. Isn't our inventory full at this point? Says there's a little bit more. Oh, gotta go up, I guess. And you can have this tungsten. Hey, why have I got my 
compass open still. We do not need that. And it looks like there's a little bit more in the floor. When I say a little bit, it really does seem like a little bit. Oh, it seems to be underneath where I am more so. Mm, I think that's basically all of it. It seems like it, doesn't it? A little bit more up in the roof. Just tower up. I think that's all of that as well. I heard the oxygen sound there. We're fine. We're fine. Right, I think that's good. It's not much, but <clears throat> it'll help. Now we've got the arduous task of getting this all the way back up through this pretty narrow tunnel that I've dug out. Luckily, I do tend to build these big enough for like one of these canisters to get up there. Only just like that. Oh yeah, you can go on there. Um, wasn't there some ammonium on this floor? A little bit in the wall. Oh, it's not ammonium. It's those stupid research things that we don't need anymore. <clears throat> Fair play. I think we can leave now and go back to silver. It seems like we'll be doing the silver train quest tomorrow. Let's see. Oh, no ammonium. Wasn't there some on the surface thinking about it? Possibly. I'm not bothered about the quartz. We got ourselves a nice amount of quartz the last time. We did a bit of farming. That was a little bit of copper, I think, that we saw there. Anybody getting motion sick by me spinning the mouse around while this is spinning around? Yeah, there was the components that I could have gone and got. <clears throat> And didn't we build over the ammonium? I'm pretty sure it was under there. Just getting inventory's worth. If there's enough here. Seems a little sparse. Yeah, Mum. That's it. Oh. And a more for a more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, well, you'll be fine. Backpack's full. That'll do me. Um, is there anything else we need to bring back from this planet? I don't think there is. We've already got the train loaded onto there, and you can get loaded onto there. Well, I'll tell you what then, I want to launch, but that's where we're going to wrap today's episode off, and um, we'll start next episode on Silver. So, thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. All comments and feedback greatly appreciated, as always. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers!